of Baltimore's main impound facility today, located off Pulaski Highway. Other tow trucks coming and going, some idling nearby with a vehicle to add to the collection. This as victims have been sharing their stories for months about the real life impacts of having a car stolen in Baltimore City. Well, I was so upset. Like, well, at first when I found out, I was trying to believe that I had parked somewhere else and that the glass didn't belong to my car. Those stolen cars sometimes totaled needing to be replaced. It did take multiple days where I had to take hours off in the middle of the day just to take care of something, whether it be paperwork or going to the impound and waiting in line with the whole Baltimore public that was also waiting for their cars. Fox 45 News starting to look into what happens to those cars after thieves dump or ditch them. In the impound, the Baltimore City impound lot, if you do visit it, you'll notice that there's like sections specifically for Hyundai's and Kia's that were smashed and I'm just lucky that my vehicle wasn't one of those.